Thanks for joining me on this video. If you haven't done so already, be sure to hit the subscribe button as well as the bell notification icon. That way you don't miss out on any new content on the channel. And also be sure to follow me on these other social media platforms. Links are in the description below. My life, Crazy. You ruined my life. <laughs> All right, have and have not fans. <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't even get through the introduction because I know this video is going to just be a... It's, it's going to be funny to do. And um, can we just stop and appreciate the fact that Jeffrey had the balls to shock or electrocute his mother? And um, I mean, I was laughing so hard because we all knew it was coming. We even knew this based off the trailer for the damn defibrillator because we clearly saw that when uh, Veronica kept, you know... Um, poking David and hitting him in the back like wake up wake up you son of a bitch and we saw Jeffrey look over twice to the defibrillator and kind of you know stretches uh, well reach his um, hands in that direction we knew what was happening next but again the scene itself was just so damn funny based off the fact that you know Veronica went from saying well you know what um oh and I actually just got a message from Derek so Keith Burke follow him on social media Keith Burke aka Derek we're actually having a conversation about the um, um, uh, the crying scene that he had in the episode. And I actually just finished recording that video. I think I'm going to title it some along the lines of, Was Derek crying out of guilt or sympathy? Be on the lookout for that video if I haven't already posted it by the time I posted this one. But in any case, Keith Burke, follow him on social media. But uh, back to Veronica. I feel like the shock itself is the fact that she was like, I'm praying that whore is burning in hell right now and then it's like when she got shocked it looked like she caught the holy ghost but was i the only one that was reminded of this particular woman uh having a quote unquote shock of her own and falling to the ground our first caress Yeah, that's right. I thought about old uh, Lady Liberty herself um, uh, collapsing on the talk show. Of, what was it like uh, several months ago? But that's exactly what I thought about a loud, wow, a loud mouth female who um, I guess you could say got taken down a few pegs based off of, you know, a shocking experience, to say the least. But, I, you know, aside from the shock itself, because we already established that. She somehow instantly got into a hospital bed, which is, again, beyond me. I, this was something that I did not expect to see until next week's episode, if that, you know. But, um, you know, she's like, I want to call, call the police. I want him arrested. And um, I'm pretty sure that it's safe to assume because Madison, the, the male nurse that was talking with Jeffrey, he said that if you say you did, then I got to call the police and I don't want to do that. So I imagine that, you know, Jeffrey pulling a Catherine saying like call a po po ho because you know uh, Catherine's like I don't give a damn if I go to jail but um I imagine that if he does call the police pretty sure Justin's going to be the one to come down and I'm pretty sure Jeffrey won't get arrested because well Jeffrey getting arrested means that Justin would be taking him to jail where why it is so I'm pretty sure Justin won't arrest him and then that'll probably lead to the scene where Justin is jealous over Madison giving Jeffrey the phone number and yada 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 but I'm pretty sure Jeffrey's going to get off of this especially given the fact that Justin tried to run her off the road so an electrocution where you know yeah I'm out of electricity jokes I don't want to just keep saying shocked and shocked so I'll, I'll just pass on that but basically it isn't so much the the hilarious scene of her actually getting electrocuted it's the fact that we now know that Jeffrey doesn't give a damn. It's like, you know, he went from stabbing her in the implant, oh, excuse me, the breast, because she claims not an implant, to electrocuting her. And then David's like, son, I don't want you to be like her. And it's like, uh, D David, first of all, he did that to save you. I mean, there was nothing else he could do. He tried grabbing her. He tried threatening her verbally. But if it wasn't for Jeffrey... Veronica probably would have picked something up and tried to hit you with it. She probably would have took the damn lamp and tried to smack you on the back. So he was just protecting you. It wasn't like he did it out of spite. True, he said, I wanted to kill her, but I didn't. But at the same time, you know, uh, David, your pacifist nature is what got you in this hospital bed to begin with. 
So yeah. Um, but in any case, I just feel like this really does prove that Jeffrey will do anything to stop his mother, which may lead to him throwing her down a flight of stairs. And I got to give a shout out to everyone. You all have been asking me for weeks to do that video. And it's over 12 or 13,000 views at this very moment. So the fact that I did a video titled, Will Jeffrey Throw Veronica Down a Flight of Stairs? I was worried that a title that long would be a turn off for people to click on it. But the fact that it got over 10,000 hits in a day let me know that if my titles are long but descriptive, then you're probably going to click on it. But I think it took me like a full day for YouTube to uh, take it off of the demonetization because of the fact that the title itself was about someone being pushed downstairs meant that not all advertisers would want to put ads on the video, but they did approve it, thank God. But uh, yeah, so I am really interested to see what Jeffrey's going to do next and what will Veronica do in um, uh, retaliation? You know, it's one thing to say, I want him arrested. But remember, you know, she sent Toxic after Wyatt when he was in jail. Does that mean that if Jeffrey's put into jail, Veronica could arrange it so she she will put some money in Jeffrey's cell that is quote unquote not as nice as Quincy was to him? So we'll just have to wait and see what happens with that. But uh, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Uh, what did you think of Veronica being shocked? What do you think she's going to do in retaliation? Uh, if she pushes Jeffrey even further, what do you think he'll do to her next? I'll put the uh, link to the getting pushed down the stairs uh, video on the screen. But if you haven't done so already, guys, click that subscribe button. It's all about having a good time on this channel, talking about theories and just having fun with the have and have not community. So thanks so much for tuning in and I'll talk to you all soon.